How do I record on this? Oh, here we go. Have you got a YouTube channel? This is, um, th this one here is called Frank, and this one here is called Oscar. There's someone at the door, Archie. <laughs> Stop. Right, let's see how much we can take it. No. No. Do you watch YouTube? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So these are key rings, and I'm desperate for subscribers, and I've resorted to asking young children now <laughs> to, to become. So if I give you one of my limited edition key rings, yeah. would you subscribe to my channel? Thank you very much. There you go. And there you go. There you go. And would you like one as well? Thank you. Would you like one, Mum? Would you like one, Mum? You sure? There's only a thousand ever made. So as you can see how desperate I am to get subscribers to our new channel, so please hit that subscribe button because we're running out of key rings very, very fast, but the numbers aren't going up fast enough. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's half term in England at the moment, which means one thing, it's windy, it's raining, it's cold. Today, we're gonna to put three drones to the test. We are gonna do the ultimate drone water challenge. And the idea is we're gonna see how much water it's gonna to take to take these drones out of the air. We may be a little bit more lenient on the more expensive ones, but it's gonna be great to get the cheap Amazon drone out. Give that a soak in. We're gonna use the DJI Flip to see how much water that can take before it starts getting affected. And then we're gonna use the DJI Matrice 4TD, which is IP65 rating, I believe to see how that gets on. So it's gonna be a really, really interesting video. Let's get going. Now, Dave the cameraman is a complete tech geek. Anything that's a bit gadgety, Dave owns. To give you a scenario, Dave has a rechargeable heated body warmer that he wears in the winter, which is beyond me how you can even buy a rechargeable body warmer. But anyway, Dave's brought this along. When I said to him about doing the drone water challenge, I said to him, we haven't got a hose pipe. So this is one of these modern things here. You push the button, and it's um, so, it's, so a bit of water comes out. So let's go and get some buckets and let's see how powerful this is and if I'm gonna need to chuck a bucket over one of the drones to take it out of the air. But the idea is, as I said at the start, we're gonna see how much water we can give a drone to take it out of the air. Ease of use, we've now gone onto an iPhone with a DJI Osmo gimbal stick. This will be a really good test actually, just to show you what the footage is like without a really fancy camera, just literally an iPhone and a, is it a mobile seven, I think, isn't it? So let's jump in the car anyway and go, go and get some buckets. We're just gonna go and check out Halfords to see if they have any buckets. Really, really limited around here uh, in Chester at the moment because home base is now closed. So there is nowhere to get, get buckets and stuff. We've got a B&Q at St Bognor Regis, which is miles away. So hopefully Halfords will have some buckets. I'm sure they do, but they'll probably be really expensive buckets. You got any buckets? Buckets. Buckets. Uh, That'll do, two pounds each. Should we get two? I'll take them. Have you got anything that like generates loads of foam? Dave, should we get a cheeky should we get a cheeky McDonald's? I'm never gonna turn down a McDonald's, <laughs> let's do it. We may as well. Yeah, we're gonna pop and get a McDonald's as well. It's nearly Friday. Thank you. Have you seen that? E everything has got small. <laughs> it wouldn't be a test day without having Archie back on the channel. How are you today, Archie? I'm all right, Mark, how are you? Archie's going to be our pilot in command. The first drone of choice is the F198. Do you remember the F198 yeah. from a previous video? I'm flyable. Look at the F198. How much it, was that? Uh, I think it's about 30, 40 pounds. It's Amazon's best selling uh, drone, apparently. This is going to be a bit challenging because there's no GPS and it's pretty windy outside. <laughs> so we, we'll see, so we can test Archie's skills to the max, but if it's dodgy, obviously we'll put it down. We've obviously got full permission to fly outside. Sub 250 grand drone, all you need is an operator ID and you need a flyer ID now as well. Let's get some water and get this in the air and give it a good old soak in and see if we can take it out of the air so i.e. it won't fly anymore by just using water. We're just going to prime this. That's not very powerful, Dave. Right, okay, Archie. Hold, hold, no. We've got the app. No, we don't need that. Yeah, yeah, so we can screen record. How do I record on this? Oh, here we go. Hold on, there's someone at the door. <laughs> hold on. There's someone at the door, Archie. 
<laughs> Stop. Right, here we go. Right, so we're recording. We can see Dave's. Uh, you won't put it on there, that's fine. We right. can see Dave's shoe, so we're now recording. Okay. <laughs> so, here we go. Test number one Amazon F198. Tell me when can to take it, it off. Can it fly in the rain? Tell me when to take it go off. Go for it, Archie. Right. But it needs to kind of hover it. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> you need to hover it in here. <laughs> it, won't, it won't go against the wind. Hold on. You need to try and get it over here, Archie. I can't. <laughs> this thing's like. Oh, no. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> it's still flying. <laughs> Is it still flying? <laughs> take, take this cable away. Hold take, on. No, no, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. It's still... Oh, no, one motor's gone. Yeah, look, we've lost the motor. So we've lost the motor. Is that it's still quite, going? Quite good, that. So I wonder what, if it's lost the motor because of water. Still going. Oh, lost two motors, Mark. Two motors down. Okay, hold on. It's actually quite good. I mean, you can't still fly, going. but you can't fly. But it lasts in the rain, all right. So that's still not working. Oh, I've lost all the motors. Okay, so that's it, so that's done. So, as you can see, you can't fly an Amazon F198 in, in the rain. Let's go on to the next test. Right, Archie, what I want to do is I do want to dry this out just to see whether drying drones out, and this isn't salt water, this is just normal tap water. So we can take the battery out and see if we can get it to fly late. Oh, it's powered on. <laughs> So shall, still, shall I try, still, shall I try it again? Let me try it once more. See if, see if, see if the motors will go. Hold on, it's, it's pairing. It's pairing. So it's pairing up, so it's still working. Maybe it, maybe it, maybe it won't. It, it does a little door pair when it pairs. So what we're going to do, as I said, we're going to dry this out right. and on a later video, so it's worth hitting that subscribe button, we're going to see if we can get it to fly again. Let's get something a bit more expensive, but be a bit more careful with the more expensive one. Archie's just filming the buckets up. It's quite sweet because the wife's just popped in and she's brought our dogs as well. If anyone doesn't know me, I love my dogs. There's one here. This is um, th this one here is called Frank and this one here is called Oscar. So I love my dogs. Um, we're just doing some water testing there. Okay, we've now got the DJI Flip. We, we, we're not going to totally submerge this because it's going to cost money to repair it. I just want to see how much water it can take. See, if you press record, Archie. Yeah, and I'm doing a screen recording as well. And you can see it's quite blowy here as well, so the Flip will move around quite a bit. You happy? Yeah. Fine, okay, so let's, let's put it in a hob. If you can record, Archie. Yeah, recording and screen recording. Okay. Let's, let, let's give it a, you know, start off quite slowly. Let's give it a bit of a brush of water. Dave, the cameraman's getting soaked. Is that you doing that? No. So, so that's the wind? Yeah. It says it's landing. So it does, it says what? It says it's landing. So it does say it's landing, which is interesting. So on, this, on the screen it says landing. So that's really interesting. So I would think water has affected that already. Shall we go over there so there's no wind? So it's proper fast. No, I think, I think we're okay here. Let's um, right. let's just t take it off again. See if it will take off. Well, what's really interesting? It's it's picking up landing, which is interesting. What's it doing now? Just flying normally. So it's flying normally. You press and record. Yeah, it's all still recording. So tell me when it says landing on the. It says landing now. That's really interesting. And then it's just gone off. It's it. So it, as soon as you start... It said landing, but it's just... Yeah, it's, it's really it, interesting. It's not actually landing. Landing, and then it just doesn't land. So it says landing. It 
So there's obviously something in the drone that's picking up this water. So if you can imagine being sort of three or 400 meters away, it starts to rain or you're in the rain and it starts saying landing. It can be quite, um, so is it saying landing again now? Yeah, I just said it. So it's saying landing again now, yeah. yeah, really interesting. So th there's no way you should really be flying these in the rain. Let's get something out that's waterproof and then let's see what, what that does. Fine. Brilliant. Just before we get going with the Matrice 4TD, I've just dried off the DJI Flip. What's really interesting is some water has actually got into the battery tray, which I find really interesting. And I'm sure that if these two short circuited while it's in the air, I believe it would probably short out and, 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 um, and li literally just fall out the air. So really, really good test and really interesting. Amazing the drone picks up something wasn't quite right and landing, but again, it just shows you none of these drones should be flown outside in the rain at all. For the final test, we are going to use an IP55 rated DJI Matrice 4 TD. These are new out, they're fixed wings, they're not foldable. These are used for public safety and you can literally fly these rain or shine. We're going to start off quite lightly and again th this, this drone is built to have water on it which is fantastic. If you've just joined in the video, the Amazon drone's toast, the DJI Flip knew it was raining or knew something wasn't quite right and some water had entered the, the actual battery tray. Let's give this a soak in. Let's get it in the air, Archie. Amazing. And let's give this a soak in. So yeah, just off the back of what Mark said, this uh, drone comes from the DJI dock, so it needs to be all weather. That's why it's got the IP55. They've also released it as a standalone combo, which the police are going to be loving because it's um, now just, it's not just the dock drone. You can buy it as a standalone combo and just take it out of the box. IP rated drone um, in that form factor, so very good. Take it up. Okay, take it. Are you going to hover it here, Archie? No worries. So there's no water light, so I'm going to try and, try and attach at the bottom for the sensors. So there's no way we're doing any harm to the drone at all. That's incredible, isn't it? Yeah, and the camera's completely clear. So if you if you um, go straight at the camera, it just it refocuses and it, it disregards all of the... Really? Yeah. Okay, so that, that's me squirting what? the camera. So look, look how usable that camera is. And that's literally got water being squirted straight into it. And if you stop for a second... And if you stop just, for a second... It just focuses again. It focuses and clears. It must be coated. I think it is, yeah. So we believe the glass must be coated because you've got a very, very usable camera in the rain. That's incredible, isn't it? Look so how clear fast. it is. It's really good. And we're, rec we're recording this so we can overlay the, um, the screen footage as well. So it needs a bit more than that. It needs a bit more? Yeah, I think so. Well. Oh, not, not too much, Mark. So let's see if see it'll, how much we can... It will be a can. sudden force. Let's see how much we can take it. Oh, no way! <laughs> That's incredible. <laughs> Do you see that? That is wicked. No way. That's incredible. Whoa! <laughs> That's incredible. The that. new Matrice 4TD is an absolute beast. It is waterproof. Just to show you, there's a full, bu full bucket of water. Just to show you how powerful the drone is. Here we go. And it's still in the air. Let's do another bucket of water over the Matrice 4 TD. Incredible. That is incredible. That's why DJI are the best drones in the world. If you've liked this video, please give us a thumbs up and a share. Comments are always welcome and we'll see you on the next video. Thank you very much.
No nothing can take it out of the air. Thanks for watching.